Let's see what possible. What is going? Um, what's going on with you, mate? <laughs> what, what's going on in here again? Wait, what? Oh no! Wait, who was that? Wait, that, that's that's Teddy Diesel. Wait, what are you doing here? Oh boy, do I have something special for you. Going into this room, you can already see the craziness. Oh god. Ooh, what a first room. To explore. Oh no! What? This is the run. Okay. To actually explain what's going on is I duplicated every single enemy and then randomized them. Getting Tech X is actually insane. For oh my god. Just don't die. Come on! Alright, take two. This time some easier enemies. That was a ghost one, right? Blood rights could be good actually. But yeah, as you see, there are a ton more enemies that there actually should be in here. And all of them are randomized. Some of these item some of these enemies should be here. Come on. Okay, this is actually harder than I expected. Oh man, there's so much going on. This is actually very hard. Like, and it also looks very hard, I assume. Having these many enemies is actually super difficult. But that's exactly the reason why I chose Tenet Judas. Him being able to go through basically all enemies, dealing big damage, having iframes. Having a, having a look at our bosses, we actually still have Ragman and... Okay, something is not right here. I mean, sure, I'm taking the three boss. Maybe he just transformed into himself, that, that could also be true. Nice, and Mr. Dolly with three black hearts, that's perfect. I'd say we immediately continue. If Dawn pulls the correct path, we'll see you soon. A library and the item room, right next to each other. Ah, oh, come on, that was unnecessary damage. But in here we have spider bots, we don't need a space by them. Okay, five free bombs, sure, I guess. Alright, what do we have here? Book of Secrets, yeah, let's lose it once. Book of Sin for a pickup. Thanks to the bomb. And Book of Goliath. I'd say we keep that one. After some kind of unnecessary damage, we're making decent progress through the floor. And <laughs> my dodging skills. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, what was that? That was bullshit. Right, next boss, let's see. Do, do you work? Yeah, Raph. But also Wormwood, so. I guess we are keeping both. Well, and I guess the mod is just not working correctly. Yeah, we have a supper. We are obviously not going to it since we need our HP. But maybe we have something like that cat in there? Let's have a look. Yeah. Nothing interesting in here. Sad. I guess that's just the continue then. <laughs> what we have in here? Guppy's paw. I mean, it's used as an hour scenario, but I guess one third Guppy? Sure. For free. I take that. And overall, I must say, I'm happy with the run so far. We are obviously taking a lot more damage than we should. But there's just sometimes so much going on, it's very hard to dodge like anything. Soul heart and options. Options can be pretty good for some extra chests and stuff. Um, we're actually bombing you. Maybe there's something to give us? No. Let's see, the boss has to be near. Which is great. Can I go through here? Awesome. Amazing. Oh, what's going on, man? 
And also secret room. What do we have in here? An item? No. Unlucky. But we have a ton of money in here. Let's see what box we What is going? Um. Okay, something is not working correctly. How are we surviving? Oh, thank you. Oh, he killed down for me. What was that? <laughs> what was that? Oh, man. I guess... I guess the haunt... No, not the haunt. Turtle. Every single segment of Turtle counted as like a different enemy. And they all transformed into different ones. Wow, that was... That was crazy. I don't feel like we can go mirror dimension in here. That that's probably too crazy. Alright, this is a big room. Man, this this laser eyes are very scary. Yeah, no, I don't trust the laser eyes. They are probably the worst enemy here. Who are you? Wait, wait, what's that enemy? I've never seen you before. Okay, but now I actually need to take care. We had one HP and what is this? Oh! Ooh, nearly plus 20 damage. Let's do that again. Oh, beautiful. Over 20 damage plus. Let's take the blood. Sacrificial dagger. Wait, that's perfect. That's amazing. That's one of the best items possible right here. Yeah, Sacrificial Dagger is probably one of the best items you can have. Since now, I can just, while I'm in my dagger, deal damage to all enemies around me. That's absolutely perfect. And who are you up there in the top right? Do you see him? Who are you, little boy? Here, take a dagger. And Shady. <sighs> okay. It was actually a pretty decent run, I gotta say. That run actually got somewhere. Wow, there's, there's been a ton of enemies. So, some rooms are just close to impossible. And hello, anti gravity. I mean, let's see what we can do with you. Because it ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. I went for the horn. And oh, Fred. Hello, Fred. Okay, this fight's gonna take a while. No! Oh, that was so close, but it also took like so long. Okay, I'd say we do a few more tries, and then that's a good introduction to the randomizer mode. This is actually so much fun. So, so much fun, so new. Plus, it kind of still fits the vanilla feeling. Like, oh boy. Like, there's so many mods that just that are just great, but still feel way too not vanilla. Like, do they still feel like mods? I don't like that feeling. Wait, hey, yo, Chop. What's going on with Chop? He's just non existent. Look at him smile. What's going on with you, mate? <laughs> the finger! Oh, the finger is super underrated. That's an instant pickup for me, dog. Oh boy, what are you doing? What are you doing? Alright, oh, here with the finger. Yeah, I can, I can just finger in there in this room and just do super the big damage. Okay, but I still got hit. That gold man. Oh my god, flip! Yes, okay. This could change everything right now. Flip for double items is insane, actually. Ooh, that was so satisfying. Okay, do we go into the shop for the flip? Probably not. I think we are still looking for the item room. And especially the item room before the boss, since we have low HP. I would highly appreciate it. 
some more damage or sorry ability. And our item room. Let's see what it has. It has camo undies. To be honest, I really like camo undies, so we are most likely gonna take them. But there was also outside here. Up there we have another item. There's a flipped item behind it, and that's its blessing, but MTR is also great. But before we do that, let's first do the challenge from up here. Marrow into Cadonine Tails. Ooh, that's also a nice damage up. Bone Heart would also be very nice. And we can actually, thinking about it, take them. In a ghost form with flight, and with the flight, we can take the charge of battery over here. Oh no, wait, who was that? Wait, that, that's, that's Teddy Diso. Wait, what are you doing here? No, don't tell me he stays for the rest of the floor. Oh no, don't tell me. That's absolutely horrific. Yeah, he actually won't go away. Oh, that's, that's kind of bad news to be honest. But next to bad news, there are good news in here. We just need a little bit more money if that's possible. Wh what's going on in here again? Wait, why so much? Why so many enemies? Wait, what's the... Okay. Okay, something is clearly not working correctly. How many were those? But I guess anyway, that's the first look at the randomizer mode. That was crazy and I really want to play this again. And especially to beat it again. We had Dean's Blessing, so... Next run, next time, will hopefully go slightly smoother. Thanks for watching.